Have you ever wanted to play along with a song and you just wanted to isolate the vocals by themselves? Or maybe you're a drummer and you wanted to take the drums out of a particular song. Well, I got something for you. Logic Pro 11 has this really cool new feature called Stem Splitter. And in this video, I wanna show you how it works in the proper application for it. Now this feature is only in Logic Pro 11, so you will have to update your Logic Pro in order for it to work. But let's get into it. Let me show you how it works. All right, we're gonna open up Logic. And let's open up a audio track right here. Let's press create. So what you're going to do is you're going to drag in the MP3 or the WAV file that you want to split up individually. You know, we're gonna have that vocals, we're gonna have the drums, we're gonna have the music, the bass, everything is going to be separate. So we're gonna drag it into Logic Pro, right? So let me actually show you where, what this song sounds like. Um, this song, the vocals are really, really loud. It's a reference song, but I'm going to show you the power of Logic. We're just going to play a little bit of this song so you can kind of hear what's happening. So we hear the music and we hear the vocals, right? All right, we got that right. So what you're going to do is you're going to right click the audio file. Once you right click it, you're going to see stem splitter. We're gonna click on stem splitter. And what I typically do is, you know, the preset is going to be separate all stems. If you want just the acapella, you can do that. But I kind of like to have access to everything individually. Um, you know, that way I just can have complete control over everything, right? So we're gonna make sure everything is checked and then we're gonna press apply. Now this works really, really fast. We see the remaining time is only 26 seconds, but it started with 29 seconds. But this is really blazing fast uh, to be able to just split everything up, you know, that quickly. Now, granted, the track that we're splitting up is only like three and a half minutes. But again, this is really, really fast and I like that. And now what you have, you have everything split up. We can isolate the bass. Now it's not going to be perfect, but it is really, really close. Check out the bass by itself. So it sounds like a little phased a little bit. Um, let's check out the drums. Let's go to a high point in the song. Hey, that's locked. Now the vocals, I feel like the vocals are going to sound really, really good. Check this out. So I won't be afraid. Yes, you are. That is crazy right there. Let's check out the piano. So the uh, piano kind of got that lo-fi feel a little bit, but overall it sounds really, really good. And this is the other, let's see what this is. This is the rest of the music. Like, that's really, really good. Um, let's hear the guitar. So that's how you can split up everything into stem format in Logic Pro. Let me know what you think about that feature. Let me know if you have used it before. Um, but yeah, comment down below and tell me what you think. But that's all we got for today. Um, I hope you learned something new. That's how you split up stems in Logic using the built-in stem splitter. Um, that's all we got for today. We are out. I believe we are building something that is going to be a part of every keyboard rig in the next two to three years. 
I've never used any type of software that is this easy where you can just press a key and the drone pad will automatically latch and play throughout the entire set.